Banana Ball has taken over social media. A two-hour circus uh, with a baseball breaking out. The Savannah Banana Spectacle has drawn a whole new wave of baseball fans to the sport. Besides the millions of social media followers, over 500,000 fans around the world are waitlisted to check out a game. The Florence Yalls are going to give Banana Ball their best shot. It's almost a bit of bonding. Um, we're going to go down there, we're going to play some ball, it's not going to mean anything whether we win or lose, but it's going to mean a lot how we compete, and we're going to learn a lot, and uh, all the fun they have and all the fun they project to their fans. The TikTok dances and in-game shenanigans are what made the Bananas famous, but there's more to it. When the Florence Yalls are down in Savannah Banana Land, it might look like they're playing baseball, but it's a little bit different. Down in Savannah, they're playing banana ball. Rule one, scoring is different. Each inning counts. Whichever team scores more runs in that inning gets a point, except for the last inning. That's when every run counts at a point. Whoever has the most points at the end of the game wins. Rule two, you thought the new MLB rules made the game quicker? Banana Ball has a strict two hour time limit, meaning no inning can start after the hour 50 mark. Rule three, a hitter cannot step out of the box. If they do, it's a strike. Rule four, there is absolutely no bunting. If a hitter squares the bunt, they're ejected from the game. Rule five, a batter can steal first base on any pitch, usually on pass balls or wild pitches. Rule six, there's no walks allowed. After a batter gets ball four, they begin a sprint around the bases. The team in the field must have every player touch the baseball, except for the pitcher and catcher before they can get the batter out. Rule seven, it's all about keeping the game moving. There's no mound visits whatsoever. Rule eight, remember your mitt. If a fan catches a foul ball in banana ball, the batter is out. Rule nine, there are no extra innings. In the event that the game is still tied after the final inning, then there's a three round showdown where a pitcher, catcher, and one fielder go against a batter and different variations of runners. At the end of that, whoever has the most points wins the game. However, if at any point a player is to hit a homer, it's a walk-off home run, the game is over, that team wins the games. Understand the rules? Great, me neither. Here at Thomas More Stadium, the home of the Florence Yalls, trying to explain banana ball, Marshall Kramsky, WCPO 9 Sports.